Today's event is called Chips for Kids. It's held every year around this time to help to, to help collect toys for those who can't really have toys for their Christmas. Chips for Kids program has been around the state uh, for over 25 years with the Highway Patrol. And so um, it hasn't been here in, Cal in Bakersfield. And so I wanted to bring that in into our community and help our local kids out. The toys get distributed by the county. The families, they have to set up through the county. The county will then distribute the certain number of chips for kids. And then on the 21st, I believe, is when we'll have our distribution date. And for that, they'll be given a little chip. They'll hand a chip to an officer or one of us or another explorer. And we'll take them around through like a gymnasium and they could get to choose one toy. They'll, they'll bring us the coin and then they'll get to go, go into our facility and uh, we basically take them shopping. The officers and uh, various volunteers will we'll take uh, each kid individually without the parents, we'll take them shopping. The distribution in my, in my opinion is always the best part. It's the most feeling that you get from seeing the smile you put on a kid's face by getting, having them get a new toy. The smile you put on their face, the excitement they have of going around, you get to talk to the, the, the person, get to know them, like see what, see what they like, what they don't like. It's our very first year of distribution, and so we were already cleaning up and putting everything away when in comes a mother and a daughter, and back then it was pouring rain. It had been pouring rain for a couple days straight. There was no public transportation, and you could really see that the, that the mom was, was ill, and so... Um, and I brought them inside and we're talking to them, they're soaking wet and the mom had just came back from chemotherapy, they didn't have any public transportation to get them around so they walked and um, you know she was asking me, can I, can, I get, can I pick up my toy still? I know we're late and I also have five siblings at home and I have their tokens as well. I said yes, <laughs> pick as many toys as you like for all your brothers and sisters and, and just you know, go ahead, you know, take whatever you like. Well, like, uh, and then I gave her, uh, I gave her some gift cards as well, and and of course she reached over and gave me a big old hug, crying. The mom's crying, and I'm crying, you know. And it was, it was just a. Just, I, I knew at that point that we have to keep this going because there's a lot of kids out there that, um, unfortunately, they, they're not going to get anything for Christmas. I know that's not the whole reason for Christmas, but it is giving. You know, we're giving back uh, to this community. Um, and so that's that's what we want to do. We want to bless other 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 people out there, um, and let them know that the Highway Patrol is here, and we're here to support them. And we would love for the public to stop by, bring a brand new unwrapped toy uh, for children ages zero to sixteen. Uh, we can't forget about the older kids. Uh, one thing that I've noticed, uh, looking at some of the donations that we are lacking in in uh, items for older kids. Um, so just think about that if you're if you're at at the store this evening or this afternoon. If you can't make it today, um, you can always drop it off um, until the 18th. You can drop it off here at the California and you have uh, any Walgreens location. You also have uh, La Carreta, Carneceria La Carreta, and also uh, our Bakersfield CHP office.